Pico 4, the future of virtual reality. <clears throat> the Pico 4 brings to existence one of the most immersive occasions. This new VR headset will change virtual reality's future with all its new features and updates. So what are its features? In this video, we are going to discuss everything about this new invention. Therefore, you must keep watching the video until the end and subscribe for more uploads. Here we begin. During a recent launch event, Pico announced the launch of its next generation headset, the Pico 4. To our surprise, Pico strives to create VR that will be more available to learners and experienced gamers by giving an exceptional VR experience emphasizing performance and solace. If we're talking about its chipset, then you will find that the Pico 4 is powered by the chipset named Qualcomm Snapdragon XR2, which is furthermore the similar outlet that is utilized in Pico's Neo 3 headset line, along with the Vive Focus 3 and MetaQuest 2, and several other standalone VR headsets. Now let's move to its features. This device has outstanding features that differentiate it from the market leader Quest 2, comprise an infrared optical positioning system, full color pass-through mode, proprietary omnidirectional slam, and advanced optical detectors, all of which assist in giving exceptional tracking and positioning for the controllers and the headset. Now, if you look at the Pico 4 headset box, there you will find a Pico 4 VR headset, four 1.5 volt AA alkaline batteries, a nose pad, two controllers with lanyards, a spacer for users who wear glasses, a 2.0 data cable, a USB-C power adapter, and user and safety charts. It's not the end to its features because we got to know that Pico has also disclosed modern motion trackers, which can be assembled to a user's legs to track their activities and give 3DOF spatial positioning. Also, the corporation will undertake a wireless kit for wireless PC VR, along with a carrying case. If you think these will be available together, let me inform you that these items will be available singly. Now, the screen and display provide striking and immersive colors, and the gratitude goes to its 85% saturation rate. In addition, Pico 4 has an outstanding weight distribution, decreasing the pressure on the front of your face and dissipating it over the front and back. All of these jointly make it a simple to play and comfortable to utilize the Pico 4 all day long with comfort. Here, in Pico 4, you will find that there are two versions, and accordingly the prices differ. For example, the 128GB model will amount to 429 euros, and the 256GB model will amount to 499 euros. Although, for all the Pico 4 enthusiasts, pre-orders for the equipment will start in October. Those who acquire the newly inaugurated Neo 3 Link will be apt to pre-order their Pico 4 equipment. This comprised more sympathetic user interfaces, menu call-ups, and all kinds of graphic redesign that one can anticipate from a modern OS. Still, there are some less expected and more exhilarating updates that we will discuss soon. For instance, the new OS can regulate 6DOF hand interactions for all the applications with the controller, if it may create some problems. The headset furthermore gives color pass-through for Toggle on AR. Now let's talk about the avatar system. First, you will find an updated avatar system that also emphasizes voice-operated lip-syncing for additional engaging social relations. In addition, the presence of an avatar SDK makes it easier for makers to incorporate Pico avatars into their creations. This wasn't the barely creator-focused statement. Furthermore, the app has a unique toolkit for developing and dealing with VR content, remote aid, and real-time screen forecast. If you look at the cameras, you will find that the Pico 4 has four external cameras along with the popular motion controllers. The Pico 4 headset has a lot of features to improve the user experience. It utilizes inside-out tracking and has vibrators with motion controllers. In Pico 4, you will get the Pico Store, which has around 165 games for the headset. ByteDance has underlined the topics that will be accessible for the Pico 4, and that means that we will be apt to discover 165 games with 6 degrees of freedom, and this category of movements is one that you can make in the games for the Pico Store. Also, we will be able to obtain new titles that are being expanded weekly. 
For all fitness lovers, this might be the greatest news for you. The headset has fitness apps to trace calories, and it enters with TikTok integration to view the content. As I already mentioned, the VR headset has a permit for the Pico Store, which is expanding new and limited games, fun athletics for fitness, and live video performances to its contribution every week. Now, you understand the Pico compels no social media to account for the usage of the equipment. Games and apps can be opened through Steam VR and the Steam VR Store. This VR headset and its advanced technology allow more real-world interaction when utilizing the equipment, comprising mixed reality capture to indicate videotape yourself within virtual reality. The Pico account is totally distinct and not related to anything. It will not be tracked online by Pico. The Pico 4 outlines flexible straps and a super skin cushion lining prepared for a substance that is outstanding skill to keep you calm and dry when you run. Just like in the post-apocalyptic New Orleans assassinating zombies in The Walking Dead Saints and Sinners. Not only this, it's anti-slip leather PU, which is present at the back of the headset and also restraint and solace during gameplay. The great news is that Pico 4 will be released on the 18th of October 2022, originally in Europe, along with some other countries like Japan and South Korea. Still, the corporation has asserted that it has schemes to launch the equipment in Singapore and Malaysia later this year, with China a likelihood at a later period. The policy Pico is seizing about the general geographic availability is fascinating as it seems that the corporation has agreed to stay away from the US market. This probably happened, as it has been assumed that Meta has a relatively firm command of the market share in North America, and formulating inroads in a similar region might not be worth the endeavor for Pico at the moment. Still, by concentrating on Europe, it can earn a huge portion of Western market share from the European continent, which may allow it to reach the US market at a prospective date, infinitely easier. Now, if we compare it to the HTC Vive Focus 3, we will find that the Pico 4 is less expensive than the HTC Vive Focus 3. Moreover, it is focused on finding the focus angle in the Vive Focus 3. Therefore, HTC Vive Focus 3 is bigger than the Pico 4 if we compare both. If you see the headband of the device, you will note that the strap head has been changed. The prior prototype had a three-part head strap, which has presently been rebuilt with an extra natural headband network on the HTC Vive Focus 3. An identical system can furthermore be detected in the Pico Neo 3 Pro, for instance. So what do you think about the future of virtual reality with Pico 4? Let us know in the comments below and subscribe for more!